Kia ora and welcome for a tour of the Dockline Tramway. This was the fourth full day of the Council of Tramway Museums Australasia, or COTMA for short. Conference delegates had a quick bite to eat and then came round to Dockline for a bit of an exploration. The first tram we took a look at was number 852, a 1940 SW6 class tram from Melbourne. It came to Dockline Tramway with its sister number 881. It is not run as a passenger service for Dockline and is pending restoration, which should start in the very near future. This is the tramway tractor, used for shunting and moving trams as needed. The second tram we saw was number 881, the sister of 852, built in 1943 also at the Preston workshops that operated from 1943 to 2015. After a short storage period in Melbourne, it came to Dockland Tramway with number 852 and overwent an overhaul and then repainted in the Auckland Tramway colours of the 1930s. Before we look at the third tram, a quick look around the tram barn. Built in 2011 when Dockland Tramway opened, it has room for three trams. Due to the area being a former petrochemical storage facility, any pit dug risked contamination and gas seepage, so instead this barn has a hoist for the tram, and we'll see that hoist in operation in just a moment. Of great interest to the Cotman delegates was the shed workshop and maintenance facilities. A small number of spare parts are kept along with some tools to service the vehicles. When the restoration of number 852 begins properly, this area will transform so the contractors have all the equipment they need. The shed also has a staff room, an administrative office for the manager, and both toilet and shower facilities so staff can leave cleaner than they arrived. The third and final tram we saw was number 466, a 1926 X1 class tram from Melbourne. Also built by the Melbourne Metropolitan Tramway Board at their Preston workshops, it operated around Footscray from 1926 until 1962. It then spent many years as a garden shed before being overhauled in Bendigo in 2002 and 2003. It then spent five years at Ballarat Tramway Museum and another year with Bendigo Tramways before making its way to Dockland Tramway as the opening tram in 2011. Also repainted in the livery of Auckland trams from the 1930s, number 466 is the main workhorse of the Dockland Tramway and operates the majority of days the system is open. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more from me, click here to subscribe, and perhaps you'll also enjoy this dashcam video from the same visit.